Hey, where's my opening noise? Maybe we're on a new game. Hello and welcome to Resident Evil 4. Um, I've... Oh god, that mouse is huge. Let me see. I think there might be options here. No, no. Uh, that looks right. Uh, so, Resident Evil 4. Uh, one, one of my favourite games. I've not played it in a hot minute. But, um... Every console this has come out on, I'm pretty sure I've owned it for it if I've had that console. Uh, so at the moment, I've not completed on the hardest difficulty on PC, uh, but I did on every other console that it came out on. Um, I remember I only really played for it on PC because I was like, hang on, I've got Resident Evil 4 on PC and I've not played it, I just have it. I, I need to change, I need to have at least completed. Uh, we'll see, we'll see. Oh, that's all the extra shield. Uh, so, uh, we're going to jump into it. Uh, again, normal because just you know, giving you the normal experience. Uh, and go. Resident Evil 4. Please get out of my left ear. 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arklay Mountains. Soon after, the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Corny, why am I the one who always gets the short end of the stick? Yo, who are you really? Come on and tell us. You are a long way from home, cowboy. You have my sympathies. Guess that's a local's way of breaking the ice. Anyway, you know what this is all about. My assignment is to search for the president's missing daughter. What? All by yourself? <laughs> I'm sure you boys didn't just tag along so we could sing Kumbaya together at some Boy Scout bonfire. Then again, maybe you did. Oh, you crazy American. It's a direct order from the chief himself. I tell you, it's no picnic. I'm counting on you guys. It was right before I was to take on my duties of protecting the president's daughter when she was abducted. That's the ultimate reason I'm in this lonely and rural part of Europe. According to our intelligence, there's reliable information about a sighting of a girl that looks very similar to the president's daughter. Apparently, she's being withheld by some unidentified group of people. Who would have thought that my first job would have been a rescue mission? Freezing. So cold all of a sudden. Making excuses. Eh, must be my imagination. Eh, sorry it took so long.
Just up ahead is the village. I'll go and have a look around. Yeah, we'll stay and watch that car. Don't want to get any parking tickets. Right. Parking tickets. Good luck. Jeez. Who are these guys? Did you say something? Leon, I hope you can hear me. I'm Ingrid Hunnigan. I'll be your support on this mission. Loud and clear. Somehow I thought you'd be a little older. So the subject's name's Ashley Graham, right? That's right. She's the daughter of the president. So try to behave yourself, okay? <laughs> Whoever this group is, they sure picked the wrong girl to kidnap. I'll try to find some more information on my end as well. Good. Talk to you later. Leon out. So, this is a legendary video game, Resident Evil 4. Uh, it's been re-released a, a host of times over the years. It actually came out in 2005. So up until now I've been playing uh, remakes of Resident Evil 1, Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 3. Um, I think this one might be after the remake Resident Evil 1, I can't remember for sure. Um, but otherwise it's way before the other two, so yeah it looks a little bit less uh, graphically impressive. But, uh, and, and just, you, you can't walk a name. Um, old tank controls but a third person over the shoulder view but uh yeah it, it's a cool cool time <laughs> forget your makeup or something Fuck. not that way cowboy i've just shown you all the unique interactions that you can get at this point in time also it's the first Resident Evil in the series, uh, mainline at least, where um, enemies drop shit. Just uh, help myself to these goodies. Ah, oh, money. You know, the, uh, my, my job just doesn't pay that well. Now, whoever that is, he probably has a bad feeling about me because I came in and I murdered two birds that were just minding their own business. Um, oh. The knife is also really good in this. Space for the knife. Let me just uh, break open this guy's belongings. Nothing? What a cheapskate. Just. <laughs> Hello? Uh, excuse me. Sir? I was wondering if you might recognize a girl in this photograph. Sorry to have bothered you. Freeze! I said freeze! No. Oh, I'm a gamer. Gamer, taxpayer, everything you need to be. Oh shit. Shit. Man, this game is loud. Is everything okay? There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take Get whatever is necessary there. to save the subject. Understood. Ah, uh, yes, uh, yes, self. He ain't no zombie. Hi, guys. 
It won't budge. They're pressing their cheeky bodies against it. I could go out there, but... I've got this house to explore. Yeah! Look at it. Look at those wiggly boys. I used to remember thinking that looked so graphically amazing at the time. I was like, oh my god, it's real. This isn't a video game. Um, up here. Get this handgun ammo. And then action cut roll out of the window. Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough. You what, mate? Oh yeah, one bullet, three kills. That's why they pay me the big bucks, because I can serve resources. Hey, where'd you guys go? Y'all okay over there? Oh, no. No. I hope we got out in time. I forgot I'm supposed to be reading this shit as well. Um, yeah, so... It's kind of a consistent issue on most consoles is that they use the cutscenes to pre-rendered thing rather than um you know happening in real time in game uh, if it happens in real time for example uh your costume would get taken over if you're wearing a costume uh, whereas in pre-rendered you'd always be wearing the on default outfit in the costumes let me just uh snipe these birds real quick don't mind your, your, your mate's death. It's okay, puppy. We're coming. There you are. Now, um... Veterans of, of, of survival horror series may recognize that dog as being a dog Huey from a uh, from haunting ground just a, a tidbit of information un palastello un palastello yourself come on mate hey Thanks for oh, oh money. I nearly lost out on some money then making a a, a, a cocky quip. How was that? Why couldn't I walk you? I don't know. I'll never know. I see you. <laughs> his best get down Mr. President impression saving his best mate <laughs> Woo! that was close Did you, oh you mate did drop something Get lost, you bastards. Alright, we'll deal with them later. Let's check out that house. All clear, not a single person. Mm. 
Not a single person. Is that a bone or a tiny club? I'll never tell. Oh. Hello. Guess there's no sex discrimination here. Better find it first. Uh, hidden detail n number number eight of this game. She's she's just dripping blood. Not only not only that, but she's it's onto the floor as well. My God, what a video game! Now, where is that ripple coming from? Oh, I'll never tell. I'll tell that secret to the grave. Yeah, not worth the bullet. Even though I wasted three of them. I saw you. Take his, take his money and his ammo. Oh, you had no money. That's a shame. Maybe if you had a gun, you wouldn't have so many uh, issues. What with all your bullets and such. Leon, how you holding up? Bad question, Hunnigan. Sorry to hear that. I'm sending you a playing manual. What? Hope you find it useful. I'll take a look at it, thanks. <clears throat> Don't do it, Leon. This is um, just breaking the fourth wall on her sentence. She's going to send you a tutorial. Hey, Where's the car? So that's uh, that's police boy. He's doing a die. And that's pretty much it. You are really loud. Hey guys, don't mind me. Why are these people? Listen everyone, I'll be honest, I'm doing this for the content, but uh, I'm absolutely nervous about uh, not doing this right. Hearing revs around me, and um, I'm not a fan of it. I'm gonna be brutally honest. I almost want to uh, go back to the baby tactic of just camping in this corner. haven't tested yet. Oh god, where's that coming from? I haven't... Okay, so tab is for my inventory. I got a shotgun in there. We 
would you give me a second to breathe, young man? I'm just gonna, gonna finagle back here real quick. In the iframes! I don't know where, where Mr. Chainsaw is. Get out of my way! Yoink! That was all worth it. Boy, there's a lot of people below me. everyone going? Bingo? Ah, uh, Leon, you old joker, you. And that's the end of the game, Resident Evil 4. Done. Honigan, I have some bad news. I've confirmed the body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Okay, so that was the uh, very bombastic opening to this game. Um, and honestly, it still, uh, still gets me. It's uh, really tense because Mr. Chainsaw can uh, really, 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 really thick it in your craw at any time. Uh, if you're getting hit by Mr. Chainsaw, you're dead. Uh, so, it really introduces kind of like a level of brutality right at the start. Um, just kind of set the pace for what you're gonna go through. Ah. Um, but now I'm free to kind of explore around this place. My heart's content. Uh, I'm kind of sad, but I can't use the mouse on this screen. I would have made sorting through shit way easier. Yeah, and it kind of um sets in stone, like, how is this going to be a different experience to usual Resident Evils? The shop is nailed to the wall. That, it's, it's a weird detail, but I guess that's just to, like, I can't push it in front of a window. What a sinister looking fellow. There's an unpleasant odour coming from Kel. Doesn't smell like a refreshing drink to me. It's entirely composed of ball sweat. Kind of um, there's chickens, sometimes they lay eggs. 
so uh, don't pointlessly kill them because you might come across an egg in your future. Look at that chick. Uh, this cow is just minding its own biz. If you attack it, it will attack you back. So, you know, leave it alone. You piece of shit. The yellow herb. Oh boy, it's happening. So, for those who don't know, yellow herbs in Resident Evil 4 are to increase your maximum health. Uh, you may have seen it pop up ever so slightly. I, mean, I probably didn't need to use that red, but um, also as you can see, there's like this whole inventory system with a grid. And like pistol sits six slots, shotgun takes up however many to fuck slots. Um, and there's no item box in this game. So if you can't carry it, you're leaving it behind. So you don't have to worry too much. Oh, that was one of those mythical, oh, it's a brown chicken egg. Uh, the eggs kind of work on the same system as herbs. So it's like a white a normal egg, white is... Uh, equivalent to a green herb, a brown egg is equivalent to two green herbs, and a golden egg is equal to three herbs. Oh yeah. Three mixed herbs, so a full heal. There's a barrel here. I thought it broken. Okay. A hundred potatoes. Some kind of liquid strip on the table. An unpleasant smell is coming from it. Is there? Oh yeah, it is. Resident Evil detail number 416. Oh, is that the bull? Jeez. Oh, the bull, the cow. Really fucking sniffing up a storm. You, know, you can kick these locks off. You can shoot them naturally. But you can also knife them. A knife is a brilliant tool in this game. I think too brilliant. I don't think that, but I believe that's what people... The, the, the bed sheets stained. I believe people believed that, or felt that, or Resident Evil felt that, because it's not as cool in Resident Evil 5. Where else? Where else do I need to search? Oh, this tower. This is, um... The beginner's choke point. In that little event. While you're up here, they won't come for you, so you can just sit here and wait it out. But... They'll throw uh, fire bombs up here, Molotovs. Um, don't worry about him breaking his ankles on the way down there. Just, just doesn't happen. Uh, and away we go. Now this is um, one of the coolest buildings in the village. Moving on. And this one at least has a, a desk, a small table, and a note. Alert order. There. There's been root information that a United States government agent is here investigating the village. Do not let this American agent get in contact with the prisoner. For those of you not yet informed, the prisoner is being held in an old house beyond the farm. We will transfer the prisoner to a more secure location in the valley when we are ready. The prisoner is to stay there until further notice. Meanwhile, do not let the American agent near the prisoner. We do not know how the American government found out about our village, but we are investigating. However, I feel this intrusion at this particular time is not just a coincidence. I sense a third party other than the United States government involved here. My fellow men, stay alert. What about your women there? Eh? I actually fought women in that village. I'm not. I'm not just breaking up out of nowhere. Why, why, why are you not saying my my town's people? Eh? Chief Mendes of the Bitoras variety. Let me go! Um, oh. Talking's fusty work. <clears throat> okay. On to the farm. Now, I'm not going to make... I'm just going to shoot that right right now. Just to spoil it for everybody. I can save in there, and I, may, I should, probably should, because... Um, this is an older game. Checkpoints aren't as a... There's my one cleared game. I'll, I'll save on two. 
Um, so, just in case you notice me, yeah, I'm down, you lasses. There's a pendant there, and 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 if, if you if you shoot it down, it falls into water and it gets all mucky. So you, you should shoot this, and then shoot that, and then take it, and then you can open this. But if you opened it, you can't close it again. It's a real issue. Hey. Well, that's him done. You are right, mate. Oh, yeah. I've been my nipples hard, let me tell you right now. It's like I never stopped playing this game. Did you see me mantle that fence? Cow. With the with the flat face. Oh look at all the stinky bodies. Stinky. That's what he said, that's what the text said. Now up in here it's like the stinking pool of manure. I don't know if that even qualifies for manure anymore. Hiya buddy, you're making a big noise at me. Also the dog's here. Hey dog. But they're away scared at the moment. Maybe they still think you're a baddie, who knows. Oi. Circumcise you for the finishing blow. That doesn't sound like he has. There's a guy out there who's not spotted me. So I'm gonna go over here. I'm about to blow medallions. 15 blue medallions, 7 inch farm, 8 inch cemetery. For those of you who destroy 10 or more, you'll be awarded. The rest isn't eligible. Well, thank goodness for that. A br another brown chicken egg? Can't imagine. Oh my god. This is perhaps the god run. The run to, to surpass Metal Gear. Also, little known facts about these medallions. They're on your map. That's the blue spots. I think this one you can even knife. Oh, man. Yeah. There we are. Damn it. Damn it. Would you push up, puppy? There's one here. And where's that last one? Up there, we piano. He's still not noticing me. He's still doing his thing up there. I can hear him. Pitchforking hay. Asshole. <laughs> Kick him right in the back of the head.
Secret down here. Was that guy behind me? Oh shit! I don't know what's going on? <laughs> I didn't. I didn't realize there was a person still around. Hello. Sit your ass down. I would have been more effective if I shot my leg. Then the head. Connor, if you if you look at this particular bit, edit it that way around. That was cinematic as fuck. Anyway, yeah, hidden secret. Uh, inside this box is a beer stein, and if you don't sell it, you can suck it with gems later. This is the last place to go. And where's my M? There it is. That's my seven in this area. Myself a spinel or a spinal or whatever you want to say. All I know is it's a low value jewel. Now, this bit might kill me. Because this is one of uh, Resident Evil's beloved quick time events. And while I, do, I actually don't mind them, I, I'm, I'm happy enough with them, um, I don't know what buttons it's going to ask me to press. Oh, X. Ooh. What the hell? Why X and C? What possessed you to think that was the answer? I see you up there. Carrying kind of something shiny. Such more axes. <laughs> okay. You you can you can tell everybody what happened here. Can I? That's why they call me two shotgun. What's up, guys? That's them dealt with. Who else wants to have a go, huh? He even dealt with all the traps in here, except for that. And that. Look at that. It's disgusting. Don't mind me, Mr. Spider. Just don't worry about that. Ah, ra 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 yourself. It's actually a very generous uh, um, safety range around an explosive in this. Like, for, for you, you'll cover your face and, like, 
you know, like sh shield yourself from an explosion but not take damage. Uh, but they all take damage in, in that kind of radius. No clues there. What's all that ruckus about? You all treat bird nests for shit. A red cat's eye. Now we'll use that in that. Uh... Um, how do I enter? Oh shit, I'm an idiot. I was trying to go to keys and treasures all along. Uh, we can combine that with the beer stein. And now it's a beer stein with a red gem in it. Look at that. What a beauty. Reload our gun real quick. How are we doing on ammo? 65 uh, handgun bullets? Oh, I need to reload my shotgun. But if I 20 shells, I've got a first aid spray, I've got a full heal. Uh, what about a uh, backspace to move selection? Ugh. Oh, that's back. Ah, oh, that's such an awkward thing. Just let me quick click and drag video game. It'll be easier for everybody. All right. Uh, let me get my pistol back out. Pistol is an extremely effective. I mean, as you may have seen, it's an extremely effective weapon in this game. Uh, because enemies um, get stunned and react to getting shot in different parts of the body. Um, especially with a handgun because it's quite precise only one shot. Uh, whereas a shotgun would like knock them back. And then you can follow up with uh, various kinds of uh, melee attacks. Melee attacks in case the explosion is what I said. A grenade. Also, these, um, because you know who gives a shit from Mal now. Um, although I might leave you to demonstrate on this. Maybe? No. Well, they are shootable. Um, in, in, in any possible scenario where you're trying to do this as quick as possible and it's, you want to do it quicker than that, you might be able to blow it up by shotgun force. This isn't going to be scary at all. It's just a sexy boy, don't worry. You're rough, don't you think? You're not like them? No. You? Okay, I have only one very important question. You got a smoke? Got gum. Look at how he's holding his axe. What a weirdo. The big cheese. What? Cheesy boy. <laughs> Silly Leon. Well, that's the end of chapter 1 dash 1. Um, let's just save. I'm, I'll save here. I'm going to end the episode now because I'm going to. Oh my god, I just pulled the headphones out. Hopefully, the sound isn't effective for you guys. Um, ugh. Yeah, I'm going to end the episode now because I'm going to see how the recording has been running. Um, and then I'm going to try and blaze through the rest of the game because there is not a lot of time left for Resident Evil 8. And I'd love to get this and Resident Evil 7 done at least by then. Because they're both very important, in my honest opinion, uh, towards Resident Evil 8. Um, Resident Evil 8 has a lot of systems from Resident Evil 4. 
and it's also a direct continuation uh, containing the same protagonist of Resident Evil 7. Um, so kind of hitting those two games is really important before I get there in my opinion. Uh, so yeah, thank you. <laughs>